I wanted to talk to you uh, and get your thoughts on Habib's fight against Al. What did you think of that fight, and what are, were you impressed by his performance? Uh, I was not impressed by Khabib's performance. Obviously, his conditioning was in check a little bit. Al Akinta, I mean, real estate agent, yes. And, you know, we keep going back and forth with that. Yeah. But he he did what he had to do, and he was an ultimate fighter. He went all five rounds. Mm -hmm. um, ex exactly what I expected was going to happen. Um, he got exposed is what I knew. Yeah, now, um, right now, do you think, is the UFC trying to get, you know, Habib to fight, you know, and try to make that fight happen, or? Don't know, haven't heard shit. What I know is I've been keeping my nose clean, making sure that my leg is healing right. Yeah. Um, as far as what the fights are going to go, the fans want to see myself and Khabib. Yeah. That's what they really want to see. I mean, Connor's got his shit going on. Um, slap on the wrist, I mean, whatever, it's not my business. So, if the shit happens, they want to go with Khabib, let's do this. Let's have some fun with it. Yeah. And, um, but after that injury happened, did they tell you that, hey, you know, we're going to try to reschedule it? I really, honestly, after that shit happened, I didn't pay attention to nothing. It was kind of distraught after a while. I didn't really pay attention to nothing. So as far as what anybody said, it was just get better. Yeah. And how far along are you? Are you almost at 100% as far as I'm healing? Or? Like 90%. I'm about 90% right now. And I'm sure you want to get back in the cage uh, before the end of the year, right? Yes, obviously, yes. I want to get back in there. You know, September looks good for me. So. And lastly, if that fight with Habib and Connor does happen, how do you see that fight playing out? I hope they both get knocked out. That's true. <laughs>